Today, Georgetown city leaders also talked about their preparations for the heavy snow, and they say the winter storms we've had last year have helped them get ready for this one. Victor Puente continues our first alert weather team coverage. Most of the government agencies here in Scott County came together this afternoon to talk about their plan for the next few days. They say last winter's massive snowfalls taught them a lot about how they should be preparing. Mayor Tom Prather led the discussion. He said there was one central idea all of the agencies wanted to communicate. We want to collectively urge drivers to stay off of the streets unless absolutely necessary. Uh, this is a storm that we should not trifle with. Georgetown's new snow plan prioritizes the roads that see the most traffic and the highest speeds. The mayor said the snow that shut down parts of the state last winter taught them some lessons. We thought we were ready and uh, we were not satisfied with, uh, with the speed of our response and we vowed to do better. Lessons they put in place just a few weeks later. When the second blizzard rolled through just a couple of weeks later. Uh, our performance was significantly better. First responders will be using Humvees and four-wheel drive SUVs to help medical staff get to work. The most crucial thing about making that plan work is that we communicate with each other and uh, we do that very well. Deputies will also be patrolling the interstate where crashes are common. But we do anticipate if we get anywhere close to the amount of snow they're talking about travel conditions being hazardous on the interstates. The city of Georgetown is working with five private contractors who will be helping with snow removal. The mayor says those companies are set to go on call in about an hour. In Scott County, Victor Puente, WKYT. And because city workers will be focused on snow removal, the mayor says there will not be any garbage pickup in Georgetown tomorrow.